They say that during a medieval Russian siege, defenders built a working cannon out of ice. But could ice really fire a projectile without exploding? The Mythbusters put it to the test. First, they checked if an ice ball could even survive being fired. Using a medieval-style cannon, they loaded an ice projectile with 230 grams of gunpowder, the minimum charge. When it fired, the ice shot flew clean through the air and smashed into a dummy target. High-speed cameras proved the ice stayed intact, traveling at nearly 1,000 feet per second. They pushed it further, using the maximum safe powder load. Again, the ice ball blasted out whole, this time even faster. Ice clearly worked as a projectile. Next came the real challenge, making the cannon itself from ice. To keep it from bursting, they built a barrel with thick ice walls. Carey tested it with 230 grams of powder, but the ice cannon shattered instantly. Reducing the charge step by step, they found it could only handle about 50 grams safely. With that limit set, they staged the final trial. Historically, the minimum range claimed was 150 yards. They they fired the ice cannon one last time. The ice ball streaked downrange at 200 miles per hour, sailing well past the target distance. The myth was confirmed. Under the right conditions, even a cannon carved from ice can fire successfully.